Rob, can you sort into words what's just happened there? Not really. No. Um, no, it was an unbelievable um, roller coaster of emotions. Trying to gather my thoughts. I thought um, that we didn't start the second half well. I thought the first, even, first half was quite even. I didn't think we started the second half well. We invited some pressure, and whether it was a penalty or not, I don't know, but we, we were 2 0 down. Um, but then I thought we grew back into the game and I thought we started to look like the stronger team. I made a couple of adjustments um, and obviously then the first getting that one goal back is key. You know, it gives everyone some belief um, and then, you know, it becomes a little bit of a blur. We're obviously the, the, but I just want to praise well, a lot of people I want to say well done to. Obviously the players for digging in and showing some incredible fight and spirit from 2-0 down away at Manchester United. And by the way, I don't know. When they've got all that, when that team's out there, they're 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 top team. You know, they're a top team. To be two 0 down against a top team like that with unbelievable individuals, um, and come back shows our lads have got a bit about them as well. You know, and um, yeah, look, it's incredible scenes to, to to score that one late on, and then they composed themselves again. The lads and defended really well. Um, didn't really concede any chances uh, once we were three two up. It was incredible. What we have to be now is respectful because it's not over. Southampton have got a game on Monday. Um, I'm, I'm not actually sure how Reading got on. You know, we're all, um, you know, so okay. So, um, you know, we, we've got to be respectful. It's, it's, you know, it looks good. It looks good. Um, but, you know, full credit to the players. That's all I can say. I just want to thank, and, and I want to thank all the fans that came as well and the club for helping make that happen. Um, they made for an excellent atmosphere. It was unbelievable. Uh, it felt a bit like a first team game, to be honest. I thought the atmosphere was great, and just with the drama that happened, how it unfolded at the end, um, was was amazing. And you know, really thankful that they came and shared that with us as well, because you know, we keep saying the next step for these players is first team football. The more pressure moments in front of fans that we can get for them like that is only going to make them better players and prepare them for the next step and the next challenge. Um, so yeah, it's you know, it was a, a wonderful evening. Um, and we'll, we'll enjoy it tonight, but you know we've got to um, wait for a few days, um, and you know we'll see what happens. You spoke loads this season about character of, of this group of players, and I suppose that was typified in the last ten minutes. It was just relentless at United's goal, wasn't it? It was. I mean, you know, if ever there was, a, well, it was. You know, we, we got back to two-two. We need the goal to uh, to get that three points that you know we're looking for um, to potentially win the league. You know. So we did throw everything at them. Um, so you know, then straight away, like I said, when we scored, I get right. Max, get back there now. You're a defender again. Now you're not a forward. Uh, trying to organise everyone, but yeah, I, I mean, it's incredible. I'm pretty speechless at the moment. I'm just really, really proud of the players. Really proud of the players. Everything that they've given this season. Uh, the, 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 um, you know, we, I suppose we can talk. Hopefully, if 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 all goes well, um, we can we can talk again next week. But at the moment, just on tonight. On this game, just being incredibly proud of the players, and and do you know what? Even at two 0 down, I was happy with how we played. Apart from that first five minutes of the second half, um, I thought I thought against, like I said, against a top top team, we were we were right in the game and and, um, and matched them in many areas. And and then when you know when that second goal went in for them, uh, we showed some belief and character. That I, do you know what? I haven't seen. I've seen a lot from these players, but I haven't seen that before. I and mean, that was incredible how they managed to turn it around, and they they did that. They did that, and they've got to. Um, they've got to keep that now. They've got to keep that. They've got to keep that because they showed something there. They're going to be. They're going to be good players. They're going to. They're going to have good long careers if they keep that. And what they've shown for the, for this season. Um, really proud of them. Really proud of the staff as well. We'll talk later on in on Monday. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, what can you remember of the crucial third goal? Goal. So who picks it out? <laughs> I think it was a brilliant move. To be honest, I think there was some really intricate football. Um, and uh, and a really really calm finish, uh, but like I said, a lot of that towards the end was a bit of a blur. I just remember um, shouting a lot and then trying to get us organised again. And um, um, you know, like I said, the players sorted that out on the pitch. They're the ones that go and do it. Um, we're just trying to help from the side. I suppose it's impossible to to keep your emotions intact at that, at that moment, isn't it? Yeah, that was uh, that was the one goal I've celebrated all season long. I've never really, I don't think I've celebrated a goal. I can't remember really. Uh, but yeah, I was lost it a little bit then. I think people will forgive me you know, in the emotion of the moment then. Um, got carried away with it, but then quickly switched on again and, and, and it's work time. But 
amazing scenes, amazing scenes. We'll leave it there and then touch base next week, hopefully. Thank you.